neurodiverse families have more neurodivergencies in them than just autism. An interesting 2017 study by Girardi et al. demonstrated that autism neurodivergence and attention neurodivergence, or ADHD, co-aggregate in the same families. This 2017 study of almost 2 million people demonstrated that autistics have a higher chance of also being attention neurodivergence than non-autistics do. So this in-clinic suggestion of the co-aggregation or the collection in the same families of autism neurodivergence and attention neurodivergence set researchers on a hunt to find the genetic link. And a few years later, in 2021, Sukli Ma et al. did find a specific gene called Shank2 that they think may be a potential gene underlying the overlap between autism and attention neurodivergence in the same families. So the main point here is, the clinical research and the gene studies are demonstrating the co-occurrence of autistic neurodivergence and attention neurodivergence in the same families. And that sometimes, some of the autistic neurodivergence are also attention neurodivergence, but not all the time. 